Well, hey there. So exciting. It's experiment day in my yard. Um, for most of the time that I've been shooting, I have shot with a glove, split fingered. And about a year and a half ago, I um, had a freak accident where I tripped and I dropped my iPad and it um, karate chopped my middle finger and broke it in three places. And so it's healed fine. Everything has been great for a while, but Lately, I've started shooting a lot more arrows, 100 arrows a practice, um, to get ready for the Lancaster Classic, which I know is a ways away, but y'all, I'm out of shape. So, uh, anyway, my finger has really started to bother me. Um, I got it checked out by the orthopedist, and he said that the break looks fine, you can't even tell it was ever broken, but that it's possible there's scar tissue around the tendon that is getting irritated. So, to make shooting more comfortable for myself, I have switched to three under, which, I didn't know that I was going to like, but I actually think I really like 3-under. But I also mentioned on my Instagram account that maybe I would think about trying a tab. And so several people really generously offered to send me some tabs. And um, my Instagram buddy Allison, who is Arrows and Anatomy, sent me a box of assorted tabs. And so I thought it would be fun to just kind of document trying them out. Um, I shot with a tab like four years ago, so I remember the basic concept of it, but we'll see. I don't know, There's some of these are pretty wild looking in here. So we'll start with this one that seems um, maybe the most familiar, second most familiar. It's got, uh, if you look, it has little flaps cut in it, so I'm not sure if that will serve my purpose. My thought was that like a tab would be straight across, you know, and absorb um, all of the string's weight and take some of the weight off, the pressure off my middle finger. So this one I'm not super sure about. It's um, a black widow tab made in the USA. So I don't know, let's see what happens. Some people have said that they didn't really like tabs because uh, they couldn't get a good anchor feel. So we'll find out. Okay. Well, it's strange. I'm shooting pretty close to the target just because um, I didn't know how things were gonna go. Hmm. So, first uh, thing, it was really strange to actually feel my naked finger up against my face. So I, I don't know that I got a good uh, a good anchor. Let's shoot this one one more time because that just really threw me off actually feeling my finger on my face. Okay. Not bad. Interesting. I don't know. It takes some getting used to, I think. All right, so the next one we're going to try is... Um, this one is a Safari Tough, again, made in the USA, and it appears to just have one little strap. It's got this little toggly doodad that I guess you tighten with. And are your fingers supposed to stick out that far? Is that like a thing? Is that how it works? Yeah. I hope you didn't uh, log on to this to actually learn something about a tab because I sure shit don't know. Okay, let's see. Oh, this one feels weird. This is, how do people, do you put your tab on after you put your arrow on? This is weird. All right. Okay. Oh, that's terrible. That, um, I don't think this one fits my hand right because I just totally felt the string just kapow on the ends of my finger. So you, Safari Tough, no, unless I probably put it on wrong. I don't know, man. Okay, next, well, now this one is clearly designed for split finger. It's got some sort of fur. I don't. I'm not gonna shoot this one because I just moved my freaking knocking point. So uh, I'm not gonna shoot split finger. But this one's interesting, at the very least. And furry. All right, next victim 
is this uh, really strange? I'm guessing this is made for more barebow archers. I don't know. It's got this uh, metal thingamajig, metal thingamajig. I know I'm such a technical person. It just probably gets boring listening to me say all these big words. So I, I'm assuming that you put the straps behind your knuckles. You know, maybe I should have Googled this shit before I came out here. I don't know. All right, so this one has this handy metal thing. Let's see. All right, two arrows in my quiver left. Again, this feels so weird. I mean, what do y'all do? Do you put your arrow on first? Well, strange. It kind of like almost ripped off my fingers with that, like when I shot it. Maybe I'm doing this wrong. Maybe I am. So weird. Okay. Interesting. I didn't hate that one. All right, hold please. Let me go get the arrow. I'm back. Did you miss me? Um. So, tab people, like what the, do you just wear it around? Do you take it off? Do you have to keep putting it on and taking it off? That seems kind of a pain in the ass. Um, I didn't hate this one. It's kind of, I don't know. I sort I love the simplicity of just having a glove on your hand and you don't have to futz around with anything else. Um, and last but not least, there is this utterly bizarre creation like there's this piece of metal and it looks like one would put their fingers in here but is what is this how is it upside down I mean what do you even do with this I think it would be a nice weapon. Is it designed to like be really painful and uncomfortable when you shoot? Should we just shoot one? Let's see. Oh, this is just ridiculous. I'm sure I'm doing this wrong. I actually didn't feel bad. Let's try another. And I know I can't quite figure out what to do with my thumb on my face, three under. For some reason, that's completely blown my mind. As has this. <laughs> okay, trying again. This is so weird. Well, I didn't hate it. I'd like to understand it more, but I didn't hate it. So, I don't know, man. I don't, I don't think I hate tabs. I'm, I think I'll practice, you know, shooting with one for a while and see. Maybe this one. I think I liked this one the best. Um, I don't know. Maybe I'll go back to a glove or maybe I'll become a tab, a tab person. But I gotta figure out what you do with them in between shots. Like, do you just wear them? I don't know. Well, anyway, let me get shooting before the storm comes, and thanks for watching. All right, I've got the weird shark fin weapon one on again. Something about it was just really appealing. I don't know why. I still can't knock a damn arrow. I wonder if I did my knocking point wrong. The, uh, the arrows sound really weird coming off the string, don't they? 
maybe it's just shitty release with a shark fin tab. Ah! Maybe it was just a bad release. Hmm. Okay. I can accept fault. Bad release again. I don't know, why do I like this one? It's so big and weird. Great, now my glove feels weird. I just thought that I would finish up with my glove and now it feels really weird to touch my glove to my face and my shot just went really weird. Thanks Tabs, thanks a lot. Yeah. Thanks for nothing. <laughs>